Now what I find really interesting is as these devices get more powerful, bigger screens, faster processors, what you're essentially holding in your hand is a little gaming console. But as these games are getting more sophisticated because the devices are getting more sophisticated, what you really need is a controller. I need that tactile sensation. So we met up with the founders of PhoneJoy, this startup company that's operating out of a space here in Hong Kong. They're getting ready to produce this device after raising a significant amount of money by a Kickstarter. Martin Kessler, so tell me about the idea behind this device and what is it called by the way? Uh, it's the PhoneJoy Play. Um, basically it's a wireless gaming controller that connects wirelessly to your phone but also tablet. It's not just a game controller, what we are selling is more a platform because our game controller also comes with an app for iOS and for Android. The user basically can just open our app and find the games he likes. So you can use up to four of these controllers to basically play for instance a game that you have on your phone but your phone is connected wirelessly to your TV. Kind of have like a console experience at home and also on the go. That's the great thing about it. I'm not really sure exactly what it's going to look like. The color doesn't matter to me so much. It just has to be sturdy, has to work effectively, and it has to work with a lot more than 250 games, which is what they're saying. But what's really attractive to me about this is that it's working for both the Android and the iPhone. I'll have to reserve judgment until I see the phone joy in mass production, but at first glance, I'm pretty impressed with this device. I have a lot of high hopes for this. So in the meantime, while I wait for the phone joy to roll off the assembly lines and into stores where I can buy them for myself and my kids, I'm Adam Natchberg. <laughs>